Hello Capricorn, thank you so much for checking out this video. This is going to be a you versus them love reading for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. It'll be a general reading, so it will not resonate with every Capricorn out there. So feel free to check out your other placements for more messages. Sometimes those can resonate more. Spirit, what messages do you have for Capricorn regarding the person they're thinking about? messages for Capricorn please all right Capricorn let's see so the situation I talk about today could have happened in the recent past okay that's two right there I really wanted one um, it could have happened in the recent past be currently happening or happen in the near future so just keep that in mind I have walking away and the world interesting so the world is kind of like the world is your oyster kind of um, energy where um, the whole wide world is at your feet and you are open to exploring it. There's possibilities, right? So a lot of you have been walking away um, to a door that's going to open up possibilities here. I'm going to take, well, I was supposed to only take one card from my energy um, and enchanted map cards but i'm also going to take a card from the wisdom of the oracle deck so let's see what we have for capricorn spirit regarding the person that you're thinking about what does capricorn need to know regarding the person they are thinking about huge thank you to everyone who has liked subscribed or commented i really appreciate your support i read all of your comments so thank you wow not for you so Scorpio just got this in the previous reading so I feel like there's a situation a person or maybe a location that's not for you and this is spirit reminding you but I think a lot of you already knew because you're walking away from something here so I think a lot of you let me just move this back sorry I think a lot of you already kind of know that something was not meant for you and that's why you're kind of walking away from it is what I'm getting. So let's look at the tarot and see what messages we have there. So the spread that I'm going to do today, I'm going to have you on one side and the other person on the other. Feel free to flip the rolls if they resonate. Spirit, please bring forth messages for Capricorn and the person they are thinking about I will not be using a clarifying deck today. I have just been using this one. I've been feeling very connected to it, so I'm just gonna go with it. Messages for Capricorn, please. Regarding the person that you're thinking about, please. All right, so let's start with the current energies for you. Current energies for Capricorn and their person regarding this connection, okay. So I have the Sun and the Five of Swords. So I'm really getting strongly, some of you left a situation or there was a loss or a defeat of some sort, but it's going to actually bring you happiness here. Maybe you're happy that someone lost. <laughs> that could be it too. Interesting. I'm feeling that I'm really getting strongly that walking away from a situation has made you very happy because I have the fool at the bottom of the deck. So that's about going on a new journey here. Maybe you're going to be traveling, doing things on your own, um, focusing on yourselves, maybe. So let's look at you, Capricorn. What are your thoughts or feelings towards this connection or the person you're thinking about? Spirit, what does Capricorn feel or think about the connection with the person that they're thinking about? Wow, three of swords. Interesting. Okay, so there's pain, heartbreak. Anything else for Capricorn and the way they feel towards this connection regarding the person they're thinking about? Temperance, healing and balance. Anything else? Could be a Sagittarius that you're dealing with here. Someone with Sagittarius in their chart, but doesn't have to be. Wow, I'm getting a lot of you have been heartbroken. Yeah. <laughs> You guys walked away from a connection, you've been healing, and you're kind of coming into your own here. You're, um, this is like the single lady card, independent, reliable, on your, you rely on yourself. 
I feel like you've healed a broken heart or are on your way to healing a broken heart here. Very interesting. Yeah, there was someone, someone was left out in the cold here. Someone suffered a loss of some sort. So let's look at your person or the person you're thinking about. Thank you. Tell me about the person that Capricorn is thinking about. How do they feel towards this connection? What is their current situation regarding this connection? Three of Cups fell out. Could it have been a third party situation? This person could also want to reunite. Um, can you tell me about Capricorn's person? Wow, okay, it could be a Scorpio. I just had death come out. Or someone that wants to go through a transformation. They've maybe gone through their own ending, possibly with you. Tell me more about the person that Capricorn is thinking about. What are their thoughts or feelings regarding this connection? Thank you. Wow, okay, this person could have been juggling several people, Capricorn, or this person just is confused they don't know what they want is what I'm getting here. Um, I think they want to change that or they're going through some sort of ending. Maybe they want to end a third party situation or maybe they want to transform the state of this connection. I just don't think they know how to do that with seven of cups here. I am going to clarify all of these. So let's get to the bottom of this. Let's start with the current energies. Tell me about this five of swords. What's this five swords about for Capricorn and the person they are thinking about? Okay, I'm just gonna take the card that flipped over. Wow, Page of Pentacles just came up. So 10 of Wands. This is all about a burden of some sort. I feel like a lot of you were burdened or carrying a lot. Maybe you were carrying this relationship or I feel like you walked away from that. Tell me more. Oh my gosh, that is way too many. Oh, I just saw the fool again. Tell me more about the five of swords. Tell me more about the five of swords, please. Someone set a burden down here. They were carrying some sort of baggage or something and that's like done. Ten of Pentacles, okay, another ten. Someone's walking away because they want stability, long-term stability. Someone could have walked away from a marriage or a long-term commitment. They put that burden down. But I'm also getting some of you, there was some sort of union here that ended or some of you are walking away towards a more loving, long-term committed relationship. Could be a Gemini or someone with Gemini in their chart doesn't have to be. So tell me about this sun. Someone's happy here. You could have had children with this person as well. Tell me about this sun. Eight of Pentacles. I feel like a lot of you are happy or this person is happy because they can now put effort into something worthwhile. I'm getting that very strongly. Tell me more about the sun for Capricorn. And their person tell me about Capricorn and their person why is this Sun here this is happiness and joy so I feel like Queen of Cups interesting some of you could have left someone or this situation to go after someone who truly makes you happy who loves you I feel like your intuition probably guided you as well to realize that this was not for you yeah, there was sadness here. Someone was focused on the past, but I think that's over. So tell me about death over here for the, for the other person. Actually, no. I'm going to start with you over here. Tell me about the Three of Swords. For Capricorn, please, Spirit. Tell me about the Three of Swords. For Capricorn. Tell me about the Three of Swords. Knight of Cups, yeah, I feel like a lot of you are healing 
from a situation and either that's opening a door for a knight of cups to come in or someone could be coming to make you an apology there's the ace of pentacles under the deck someone could maybe think i really messed up i didn't make up my mind i didn't treat capricorn right i'm i'm serious now that could be for some of you for others of you a world of possibilities is open because you realize something was not for you and you're walking away and here's a knight of cups ace of pentacles kind of confirming that tell me about temperance tell me about temperance here thank you page of wands and the moon i feel like a lot of you are taking tentative steps here to go on a journey into the unknown some of you are trusting in a spiritual advisor or in your into you're using your intuition to guide you could be a pisces that you're dealing with but it doesn't have to be what i'm getting here is you know page of wands he has like a an initial spark and it inspires him to take some steps forward tell me about this nine of pentacles tell me about the nine of pentacles please for Capricorn. Three of Pentacles. Interesting. Some of you, I feel like, have been working on yourselves. Self care. Interesting. Six of Cups under the deck. There could be um, a third party situation here. I'm seeing this as the past here. The past could be coming back to tell you they want to work on something here with the Knight of Cups or a past life connection, possibly. So let's look at this other person. Tell me about death. Tell me about death, please, spirit. What's death doing here? What's this about? three of wands someone has sent out a message of some sort is waiting for something to come back to them i'm getting tell me more about the three of wands What's this three of wands about oh they just fell hold on oh wow oh wow wheel of fortune just fell out so definitely someone here's going through a transformation there's been a big change here bring this down a little bit there's been a big change here is what i'm seeing i feel like divine timing has stepped in here or the wheel is turning here and there's going to be some big changes big transformations taking place here let me bring this down too i feel like i'm running out of room <laughs> Interesting. So tell me about the Seven of Cups. Tell me about the Seven of Cups here. Sorry. Thank you. Hermit. Interesting. Someone is really thinking about this. Wow. And the tower could be a Virgo that you're dealing with. But more than anything, I'm getting that there was a tower moment here that has caused this person to withdraw and listen to their inner voice and really figure out what they want. How they're going to go about this yeah i have two of wands under the deck this person's waiting for something i'm not sure what but they're waiting tell me about this three of cups tell me about this three of cups this person could be wanting to reunite um this person could be wanting or dealing with a third party situation of some sort or just there's i mean someone here is celebrating something they could be celebrating the fact that you're single over here <laughs> let's see oh. yeah there's some sort of celebration happening here with there's four of wands you could meet this person at a party a wedding an engagement a celebration of some sort this person's probably celebrate uh well hold on tell me more about this four of wands please thank you yeah i knew it i knew it 
I was gonna say this person's probably celebrating the fact that your long-term commitment is over and look what just came out. Ten of Swords came out. So it could be a couple of ways here. I have the Ten of Swords, I have the Eight of Swords, and the Seven of Swords. So someone could have been um, found out that they were in a third party situation and something ended because of that. Someone was probably sneaking around or lying um, and someone didn't know about it and it caused a an ending here. Um, for others of you, this person, they're, they're going through some a major change here. They're going through something here and I feel like they might want to reunite. They might want to take advantage of this situation. The fact that someone's recently single here. Um, the fact that someone is no longer tied down. Bottom of the deck is the Six of Swords. I feel like they're going to make a move now is what I'm getting. They see an opening. But I don't know what the outcome will be. I don't know, you know, is this person here going to make an offer or accept an offer here? Because there's an offer on this side. I don't know if this person over here has figured out what they want. And also what this offer is all about and what this not for you is all about as well. Also this moon. I'll leave it here, Capricorn. Thank you so much for checking out this video, for liking, subscribing, and commenting. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much once again to everyone who has supported the channel. And I hope I see you guys in my next video.